Welcome to the Expedition Log Analysis Feature Module A video. In this video, we will go over the details on the remaining steps for rule enrichment feature, which includes Enable rule enrichment, Rule enrichment discovery, Import discover rules back to project. First step, Enable rule enrichment. Begin by logging to the Expedition GUI, Navigate to Policies. Select the corresponding device group. In the example here, I will select DG1. Highlighting the security policy you want to enable for rule enrichment, right-click, select Rule Enrichment, Monitor, Selections. This step will enable rule enrichment on this security policy. Second step, Rule Enrichment Discovery. After we tag the rule for rule enrichment, we will click on Discovery green button located in the center, select Rule Enrichment. This will pop up another window where you can specify the option to override the time range defined previously in the lock connector. For example, I had a defined last seven days in the lock connector configuration. I could define three days here, and this will take preference from the connector configuration. Also, you can specify the threshold to discard traffic. For example, you can set a threshold to discard any traffic that's less than 10 hit counts or less than 10 bytes. When you're ready with all the options, you can then click on Analyze Data to start the uh, traffic log analysis. Once the process has started, you will see a gray panel show up and it says starting task. Immediately, you will see a URL pop up here and you can click on the URL to monitor the status of the job. The step usually take about one to five minutes, depends on how many traffic logs you need analysis. Once the analysis has finished, we will get something like this. This information is based on the logs previously processed and stored as parquet and filtered by the log connector and the security rules tag for rule enrichment. You can tag as many rules as you want and perform the analysis at the same time. For all the rules, each one will create its own results. From the output, uh, we can see Expedition has calculated if the port seen using the application is the same as defined in the application default. To tell us the service can be considered application default, if it cannot be identified, you will see the port discover. The major difference between rule enrichment and machine learning is rule enrichment produces less rules than machine learning. It will only produce four to six rules based on the application and service ports. The rules will be grouped based on the six categories. Application is unknown UDP. Application is unknown TCP. Application is insufficient data. Application with application default port. Application with custom service port. Application is incomplete. Third step. Import Discover Rules back to project. As an alternative, you can download the output in Excel by clicking on Export Excel, then you can view the output in Excel. When you're ready to import the rules back to project, click on Import into project. Here we can select the fields we want to import of the rules. Uh, I want to apply to all rules, and I want to import application field, source zone, destination zone, and check create if the object does not exist. What this does is if the service object or address object does not exist, Expedition will auto-create those objects. Source object. We can import the source object as a single IP, or we can import the source object as slash 24 networks. Same thing as destination, we can import it as a single IP or network object. Services, and we can select either replace the original rule or we clone the rule on top of the original rule. 
here we will select the device group where we want to import the policy and click on import. Once the import is completed, you can see the there are two new rules that's imported back to the project that's cloned on top of the existing rules. Uh, the only two rules that Expedition did not import are the application field is showing insufficient data or incomplete. The rest of the rules will be consolidated and imported back to the project. If you encounter any issues during the rule enrichment process, you can issue this command to look at the error logs. You have completed this module. Please move on to the final module, module 10. Push modify security policy back to PanOS devices. Thank you for watching.